you are in second charge. I was so happy uh, because of the people, people we prayed, the gate held. It has just been amazing. We truly thank God. My name is Reverend Paul. I'm serving as the senior pastor of Sitam Thika Road. Wow, it was really fun. I saw God doing very, very great things. So many people, so many people received the Holy Spirit. This evening, after the sharing, which was very powerful, he took the church through understanding about the work of the Holy Spirit, the, feeling, the infilling of the Holy Spirit, the baptism in the Holy Spirit. And I like a statement he said, that sometimes one of the blockage why we don't operate in the power of the Holy Spirit and being baptized in the Holy Spirit is when people think that because you are a Christian, then you automatically have the Holy Spirit. And he has taken us to the book of Acts chapter number two, uh, where during the day of Pentecost, and he has explained it, and then he called people for prayer, those who desired to be baptized by the Holy Spirit. And we have seen it happen. Baptize him now. People were touched by the Holy Spirit and uh, we had all this experience, people falling down and some were full by the Holy Spirit and some were loving, some of them were crying and some of them were just trembling before the, the presence of the Lord. He had explained it that as people are being filled, there are a number of things that are going to happen. And I actually blessed the Lord because he said, until that moment you feel it, you come forward. There are people who came forward, there are people he specifically called, and exactly what he had shared, there are some people who are going to be, uh, to, who are going to fall as it is. The Holy Spirit fell upon the disciples in Acts chapter 2. There are people who fell uh, uh, as he prayed for them and they were filled with the Holy Spirit. Powerful ministration we have experienced today. God bless you.